your official mail-in ballot, which you receive in this envelope here. What you're going to do is open it up and take out your inside envelope. Inside that envelope, you will find a letter that explains to you why you're receiving this ballot, your options if you need any help for this ballot, any kind of questions you have, we have phone numbers on there and website information for you. As well with that letter, you will find your ballot. Every ballot is marked by your municipality, which you'll find right up at the top of your ballot here. You have all of your candidates in the columns in the gray column here at the end, it tells you the race and how many you can vote for in the row going across. If you want to write somebody in instead of voting for a candidate that is on your ballot, you will need to write their name and fill in the oval. All of the choices are made by coloring in the oval like you see in the picture here. You do have um, candidates on the front and you have questions on the back. You do not have to vote for every office or question that is on here. You can vote for what you wish to vote for and just fill in those ovals. Once you have completed your ballot, you're going to take it and you're going to place it inside this envelope. It has a tear seal. You will tear that off and seal it, leaving this do not detach on the outside of the ballot. You need to fill in the information that is on here. It is your name, your address, your municipality, and you sign on the line. If you have difficulties coloring in these ovals, you can have someone assist you, and they would need to complete the bottom section stating that they helped you fill in your ballot. Once that is all in there and this is all completed, you're going to then pull the flap out of this envelope, stick this one inside, Peel this seal off and seal it. You then put your name and address at the top on the back here, and you can either mail your ballot, you can hand deliver your ballot at the Board of Elections, which the address is here, 129 Hooper Avenue, or you can place it in one of our drop boxes. The drop box locations can be found on our website at www.oceancountyclerk.com.